such a controversy tonight involving the arrest of a musician playing underground at a New York City subway station. Yeah, a rally this afternoon organized by other musicians angry over the arrest Friday of the guitar playing singer. The law says he can play. But a New York cop apparently singing a different tune. Here's Tim Fleischer. Their performances, normally echoing through the labyrinth of stations and platforms in the city subway system, now rings loud, drawing attention to the recent arrest of one of their own. And in Andrew's case, and in my own case, we saw wrongful arrests. We got bigger problems in New York City than some of the finding people like me down here. This was Andrew Colleen, guitarist, singer, and subway performer on the southbound platform of the G train last Saturday when he was confronted by an NYPD officer. He told me to back up before I started the new song, and I, I said I would not. During this video, lasting seven and a half minutes, Andrew and his officer disagree on the law regarding these types of freelance performances. But the transit authority says, you're not playing out here without a permit. No, he doesn't. Andrew argues that these types of performances have been legal since 1985, yet he says he and others are targeted by police. I'm asking you, it's not okay. It's not, not the way to live. Andrew then starts playing and singing. <laughs> MTA officials tell Eyewitness News they do not know why Colleen was being asked to leave the station. But at one point, the officer proceeds to arrest Andrew, calling another officer. When I said no, I knew that I was going to be arrested. You think he was going to get that rough? He was going to hit you in the head with a guitar? I, I was surprised when I was hit in the face with my guitar, yes. The unlawful arrest that musicians get and vendors get need to stop. The NYPD officially says Andrew was issued a desk appearance ticket for loitering. Reporting from Williamsburg, Tim Fleischer, General 7 Eyewitness News.